Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It's your boy DJ Short E from Philly, and I'm just making a try and make a quick video to show you how to update your um, players to the new version for um, Denon Engine Prime. Um, this one has already been updated, and together we're going to update this one. I'm going to show you on my screen. Excuse the wires, but this is the labs. Uh, okay, so with the update, I have. Now I have both waveforms on the screen. Okay. Um, so I'm playing a song on this, this layer. I go to my second layer and I'm playing a song. And you can see them both. See how it switches when I switch the layer? One I have on a loop, the other one I don't. Okay. So we're going to have it so when I play a song on this player, you can see the waveform on this player and, and vice versa. So we can have both waveforms on here with the new update. So what we do is, let me stop this. Sorry if that was too loud. All right, so what we do now is go to my computer and I start the update. That's what you'll see on your screen. Let me turn this light off. I'm sorry. Maybe this will help. No, it didn't help. Anyway, this screen says update SC6000M Prime. Because that's what I have. Alright. So I turn on my player. While we're waiting for that to turn on. What I do is you click on that green bar. Left click. And it says, put device in update mode and connect it to this computer VI via USB. To enter update mode, open the utility page and press reboot. Sorry. Open the utility, I'm sorry, open the utility page and press reboot next to update firmware. So, I will go here, click on view. It's showing that both of my players are mismatched, so I, I gotta update the firmware. Let me turn this one off real quick. All right. So, scroll up. Now, see how it says firmware version? It lets me know it's at 1.52. But we wanna take it to 1.6, which is the new one. So, you hit reboot. Don't hit this one. Hit reboot. Reboot into firmware update mode. Yes. Wait a couple seconds. Okay. Now we're in firmware update mode. And I don't know if you heard that chime, but it's showing that it's registering on my laptop as, as um, the player. So I'll click again on the green. It's transferring the information. It's already moved to step three. <laughs> so it, it was step one, two, and three. And it's already on step three. So it's updating the player now. I'm going to pause this so y'all don't have to sit here and wait. I, I, I mean, no, I guess you can fast forward it. And because I don't I want to make sure you don't miss any steps. Let me um, move my webcam out of the way. In case that's in the way. Okay. No, do not power off your or disconnect the device. That means do not take out the USB. Do not turn it off. And please don't turn off your laptop while you're doing this update. If you do, I'm pretty sure you'll have problems. Then you'll be in the Denon group complaining that the update didn't work. It bricked my, my player and everything because you didn't follow directions. Now it says done. So I click done, done with the computer. I'm just waiting for my, my player to reload again. It also, I don't know if you noticed when it clicked done, it disconnected from my computer. So I can unplug this now. Now it wants me to um, pick the source. So what I did when I updated this one is when it, when it got to this point where it asked me 
to pick the source. I know I have a drive in here. So what I did was I just turned it off because I didn't I didn't have a USB stick on me at the moment. So I just turned it off, turned it back on.